Hi everybody, I'm Mark Rogers from Niagara Falls, Canada. And uh, I started playing drums when I was eight years old. Um, I'm self-taught, uh, not by choice, but back then there was no drum teachers in the area. So uh, my parents asked the, the local music store uh, what they should do. And the guy said, just put him in a room with some records and he'll figure it out. So that's what they did. They put me in a room with uh, uh, Iron Butterflies, Inagata da Vida, and uh, Led Zeppelin II. And that's about all I remember from being eight years old. And from there, it just developed. And uh, I have yet to stop playing drums. And I'm 54 years old in August. And uh, my early influences were guys like uh, Danny Serafin. Uh, from Chicago, and of course, uh, Buddy Rich, Gene Krupa, those were the, the, the drummers of the day, uh, before my day, but I was fortunate to see them both uh, when I was young. I saw Gene Krupa when I was seven, actually, and uh, I saw Buddy Rich a few times uh, as a teenager. And then, uh, you know, my tastes developed, starting out playing, you know, more rock and uh, hard rock, uh, and then I got into jazz, through uh, mainly through my high school uh, music program. We had a great uh, jazz uh, uh, scene there. And then uh, uh, I started getting more progressive music. And I think when I was uh, in my late teens, I was in New York City and I heard James Brown and that kind of changed my life. The, uh, 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 I started getting from there, I started getting into funk, R&B, soul, and, uh, and just a lot of uh, reggae music and then African music. So a real stew of uh, roots music around the world. And uh, my journey has continued to this day. I'm still discovering, you know, great uh, styles of music, great drummers from the present and the past.